Hello and good evening. I'm Amanda Wilkinson and I'm here to do a tarot card reading for you today. My deck. Um, this is not for any zodiac sign. If you're called to this video, then it is for you. There is no gender in tarot, although I will say he or she, but just understand that it is either or. Let's start. Oh, cut the deck. All right, first card out. The moon. The moon is Pisces energy. Um, got the moon and the sun up there, and there's dogs or wolves, and there's a lobster cl crawling out of the 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 water. This is about um, secrets, lies, deceptions, masks. I know how I feel about that energy. So something good is crossing. What is the obstruction? Oh, the temperance. This is Sagittarius energy. The temperance talks about divine timing, being patient, um, waiting because something good is coming. Oh, I like that better. Moon. What is known consciously? The page of pentacles. The page of pentacles um, is earth energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, this is a new offer. This could be um, a promotion, a raise, or a something that you do that will bring in some money. Pentacles are a nice energy. Unconscious. The Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands can be feminine. She is sensual, sexual, good looking, charismatic. She is, oh, she has fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. What is behind you in the past? The three of wands, more fire energy. Um, he's waiting for something. Um, the two wands here are uh, indecisiveness or waiting. He's got his hand on one of the wands. And we'll see. What are you waiting for? Near future. The Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords, air energy. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. She is sitting in her power. Um, she will drop a sword and cut you out of her life if she does not get cr truth and clarity. So she, she is, I don't know, the ice queen some people call her. Where do you find yourself? The empress. Oh, what beautiful ener energy. This is, um... This is Libra's card. Um, she is sitting in her power. She knows her worth. And she's not getting out of that throne. For, for anybody, you need to give her truth and clarity. Like the Queen of Wands. But the, the Empress energy is... Is very very positive let's see external influences the Emperor oh we got a power couple right here the Empress and the Emperor oh I like that the Emperor talks about oh Aries energy talks about um, like sitting in his power he's pretty direct it's like my way or the highway with him but and the empress is the third number three and the emperor is number four kind of like that for you hopes and fears hopes or fears the nine of cups oh happiness joy 
wish fulfillment this is a very very strong energy cancer pisces scorpio this is a very positive card and general outcome the two of wands hmm. fire energy and two of wands he was waiting for something and like for his ships to come in bottom of the deck the three of pentacles three of pentacles talks about um hard work hard work paying off but only problem I have with the three of pentacles is that it could be there's three people here oh the star the star this is a wish card this is a beautiful card she is a queer it is Aquarius energy and talks about wish wishes come true five of cups five of cups there's three spilled cups behind him which is talking about heartbreak and he's pessimistic he's sad he's heartbroken and he's but there's two cups here if you would just turn around he would see that there are two cups which talks about love and union and a pair which emperor and empress four of cups three cups here and source is trying to give give uh, this person a cup of love but this person's not ready yet probably relaxing recuperating the ace of swords the ace of swords talked about truth and clarity um so with the queen of swords she wants truth and clarity or that sword goes down but i like the power couple some goods coming for you my cards have been jumping today love card let go of control issues allow this situation to unfold naturally which is like divine timing don't rush don't rush well you're not rushing anyway with the five and four of cups playfulness to recapture romance allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine it's nice too stay optimistic about your love life positive thinking and faith will bring you relax bring, <laughs> bring you romance sorry I'm tripping over my words all right so I like it I like it I love the Emperor and Empress here it's very very good energy so that was your reading I hope you have a great night and we'll see you tomorrow bye